A bull. Really? I go fishing for fish and I get a bull. Actually, I'm going fishing for enchanted stuff, like that's what I like most. But instead I get a bull. Nice. Hey there, everybody. You caught me doing one of my favorite things. I'm here on Cubeville, just kind of hanging out. There's the spawn area over there. And um, I love this little pond. It's so cute. I just think it's adorable. There's a little dock. I like to jump out of that tree. <laughs> it's just a fun little area here. Um, one of my favorite things to do is to stand around going fishing. I don't know why. Maybe it's because I like to go fishing in real life. Um, you know, it's just peaceful. It's quiet. It's just something to do while I'm passing the time, I guess. I don't know. Anyways, I just hopped on Cubeville really quick to do a few things. Oh, I forgot. Hang on one second. I forgot something. Ta-da! I'm a turkey! In more ways than one. <laughs> Gamer Spot? Spot Gamer? I never get your name right, honey. I'm so sorry. Anyways, she made this awesome skin for me. They made this awesome skin for me. And, um, yeah, it's a little turkey. It's got little feathers. <laughs> it's so cute. <laughs> because Thanksgiving's coming. We almost have Thanksgiving. And uh, so, yeah, I just thought it'd be very festive to change that out. <laughs> um, I just wanted to run around on here and uh, check out a few of my favorite places that I like to go and see. When you come into spawn, you see these big letters outside of the area, which tells you which direction you're going. I love that because I get lost all the time. So I like to go over here and check my mail. Who doesn't like to get mail? In real life, I love mail. You can also get it here on Cubeville. If you talk to Creeping, Creeping Despair, you can get um, a mailbox in their rentals. So you can rent out these mailboxes. I don't know if I have anything today. Oh, so sad. I don't have any mail, but that's okay. Minnie? Oh, Minnie's got a cookie and random items. <laughs> oh, Munchie, you've got dirt. That's, that's awesome. That's awesome. <laughs> so I always like to check out my mail and then there's one other place that I like to go and check out. Let's go check that place out. It's a little bit of a run, so I'm going to, yeah, let's go see this. It's to the north. Probably could have kept going the other way, but that's okay. It's this place. It's, um, what is it called? Um... I don't see any signs. I think if I had my chat on, it would tell me what it's called. Because I always forget what it's called. But you can also get... Um, that's a shrine. That's funny. You can get uh, mailboxes here, too. There's all sorts of... This is the positivity challenge-like thing. <laughs> you can follow all these rules and everything and talk to the person in charge. And then you get a mailbox here. And inside this mailbox is such a fun... Um, everything's very positive. Have a great day. You are amazing. Wow, that's a really nice respiration. Okay. Um, storms never last. Phoenix must burn to emerge. Uh, okay. I always call that gum. <laughs> I know it's not, but I call it gum. A cookie a day keeps a Wally away, but I don't want to keep Wally away. Wally's fun. Um, I can't even say that. Dreams are meant to become real. Go with the flow. Yes. Uh, be bright, be happy, be bold. You can, you should, you will. Oh, I just love it. I just think it's really cool. You can also donate items here. Like, maybe I should give them a bowl. No, no. Give them something good than that. Better than that. But you can get a mailbox here, and then it gets filled with all of this fun stuff. And uh, I, I just love it, because, you know, it's like, it's like getting mail every day. Not to mention, there's a really awesome build over here. Has everybody seen that yet? I totally love that can actually go up into it using the lift signs over there. That is just amazing. And then the stack buildings over there. So yeah, these are just a few of my favorite places that I like to run to and um, check out while I'm on Cubeville. Maybe you will too. There's so many places to see on Cubeville. I, I don't even know where to begin most of the time. Oh look, I might actually stay on the road all the way back.
Now, the main reason I wanted to come here is to tell everybody that Halloween Island is almost over. It's almost done. So you need to get out here and finish up all of your quests that you've got going on over here. Um, and uh, yeah, you totally need to get out here and finish all that up and then get your fun prizes. Um, which way, which direction is this? South. If you go south, you've got the lovely portal right here. You can just go ahead and go into that and show up in the awesome Halloween Island area. I wanted to show everybody a little bit of some of the fun stuff that you can still do while you're out here. Where is that tower? There it is. One of the things that you can do, one of the quests, and I haven't been able to find all of these items yet. Uh, it's kind of a frustration. I still haven't found all of them. But if you come in here and speak to this lovely fine person, they're gonna send you on a quest to find all of the pearls and the pearls are hidden all around out here. Like, I think there was one right over here, wasn't there? Yeah, there it is. I was gonna say, I thought I saw one right there. So yeah, there's one right there. Um, some of the buildings have them in there, uh, not all of them, but most of the structures that are out there has a pearl in it. So always go looking for those houses. Um, some of them are upstairs. There's, you know, upstairs in different areas. They're just all over the place. There's 20 of them. I have only found 18. Ugh, I can't find the last two. Um, I kind of gave up. <laughs> I, I have to be honest. I, I kind of gave up. So, yeah, you can do that quest. The main pumpkin that I seem to be going to a lot right now with most of the quests in it is the one that's to the north. Oh, I think I see a pearl over there. Ha, huh, there's another pearl. Yeah, I already got that one. <laughs> the ones I'm missing are probably so hidden, I, I can't even. I can't even. So, anyways, um, the PvP arena has a quest in there. You talk to those people, and they ask some questions, and you have to answer them. Oh, yeah, make sure you empty all of your stuff into your ender chest, or it'll disappear when you go into the PvP arena. Oh, somebody changed the photo booth. That is so awesome. <laughs> One of the quests that I didn't even really know about is right over here. And it was really fun. I had a blast. I finished the whole thing. It took me a little bit, but it wasn't too bad. But you talk to this fun person right here who looks a little, I didn't notice, but she's a little gray and black and white there. She's a little gray. Um, and then she's going to send you on a quest to find um, certain things. Almost everything is everything is in this area right here. I was trying to see if I could find the easy mushroom. There's like these little, they look like this, but they're rainbow colored mushrooms. At the end of the quiz, you have to um, find those. But basically you go and speak to that person, do your slash one, slash two, whatever. Um, and then you start it out by coming over here, jumping in that hole. I don't, I don't wanna jump in the hole right now because I've already done this. So I'm just letting you know how you can do this. Um, and so then there's uh, several rooms that you have to go through and find things in um, to proceed to the next room. Not very hard at all. And then you come back out here, um, speak to her again, and then you've got to find those rainbow colored mushrooms. And they're all hiding in this area here. <laughs> there's something up there that I didn't notice before. I was like, what is that? I don't even know how to get up there to see that. Oh, hello, mushroom. But anyways, yeah, so all of those things are hiding in this area here. It was a ton of fun. Not too bad. Oh, there's one. See it? See it? There's the rainbow mushroom right there. So, yeah, they look like that. After you finish the um, tree quest stuff, then you can come back out here and find those. It was a lot of fun. I had fun doing that one. So I hope everyone does that one because I didn't even know it was there at first. Like, oops, I'm sorry, my bad. Now, one that I did struggle with for a little while was the um, Mad Scientist house over here. Let's go check that out real quick. I get so lost in this house. Well, I'm better now, but I used to get so lost in this house. The first thing you wanna do is go upstairs all the way upstairs watch this i'm gonna run out nope nope see i so many times i would run out here and i'd be like hey wait a second this isn't the right spot <laughs> oh 
So you come up here and you talk to the scientist and he wants his porridge. That's the first thing he wants. There's several steps to it, but he wants his porridge first of all. Um, and the porridge, uh, 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 uh. I'm going to run into all the posts and everything while I'm going down these stairs. Oh my goodness. The porridge is in here. And the way you pick it up is by um, opening the chest. And th by opening the chest, I, what I didn't realize is I was like, oh man, I, I don't have it. Where did it go? What's going on? Something's wrong. But then if you do slash, oh, my chat is off. If you do slash backpack, I turned my chat off for the video. If you do slash backpack, it actually showed up in there. It was in my backpack. So this quest is something that can be done. But most of the time, the items that you have to go and find here in the, the labs and everything else, they're in your backpack, and that was confusing me so that I couldn't finish the quest. Once I figured that out, I was on my way. So then you can do the slash one, slash two, whatever, to answer his questions. And you can look in your backpack and find those items and totally get lost in the house as many times as I did. Maybe not. You guys will probably figure it out a lot better than me. <laughs> I got lost way too many times in here. But yeah, that's another fun quest. Um... I have not been able to finish the Mario parkour. I can't get past the bridges. I don't think there's really anything over there. I didn't try too hard on the um, maze. The entrance is over there for the maze. I, the fire maze. <laughs> I just couldn't do it. I, I don't know. I'm just not very good with mazes. I get lost in very simple areas. So trying to do that was not working for me. But um, the parkour in there is just amazing. Ashy did a fabulous job with that. That is just awesome. Um, over here, though, they opened up the stores. You can go shopping. You can use your pumpkin points and your candy points or whatever they are. And you go up and you right-click these people. And I've got my chat off, obviously, so it's not going to work. Um, there's costumes in this one and costumes in this one. They each have three. This is awesome i love that one i bought that one um and you have to put everything there it is in your ender chest or you're going to end up losing it isn't that cool flames it's a flamethrower <laughs> i love it because i always have candles and torches so there you go right like there you go i think it's so cool super cool super cool <laughs> So I got that one. That one was one of my favorites. But please remember to not leave Skylands, not leave, well it's not Skylands, not leave the Halloween Island or go into the PvP arena with those awesome items. I also got the donkey. Oh yeah, I got the donkey costume. <laughs> there you go. I think it's so cool. Oh, my hands actually, my hands actually match it now because <laughs> I'm the turkey costume. That's awesome. Um, so yeah, get a costume and then head on over to the photo booth with all your friends. Take a quick screenshot because this island's not going to be around for very much longer. You don't want to miss out on any of the fun around here. Just remember to put the items in your ender chest before you leave. Because like I said, they will disappear if you don't. And you don't want to lose your awesome items. Um, they need to stay here for now. And uh, later on, I think we're supposed to be able to have these same shops or same ideas in the overworld. So we should be able to get our awesome stuff over there too. I I'm not sure on that. I don't have, I haven't figured that out yet. <laughs> One of the ways that you can keep up on all the news on Cubeville though, and people are not, they, not everybody knows this for some reason. Not everybody does this yet. And I'm telling you, it's the easiest way to keep up with Cubeville information. Simply go to the Cubeville website. It's cubeville.org. And while you're there, you can vote really quickly at these three sites. You can vote at all of them. But these three sites here will get you 10 cubes to use in the overworld. So you can go shopping and get those diamonds or obsidian or enchanted swords or enchanted books is what I usually end up buying so I can enchant my stuff. You can get that all there. But if you go to the forums, head into announcements, um, here's information on Halloween Island right there, and there's something new and cool. Look at this. We now have a Discord channel, and the way that you can use that is by getting into the Discord channel first and then setting a mod request out with your name that says, I need to be activated on Discord. 
and we'll get you put it in there and you can chat with all of your friends online while you're right here in the game. I love it. It is so, it is so cool. And there are so many people over there and it's a ton of fun. So you can do your PVP and be yelling and screaming at each other. Well, don't yell and scream. No, <laughs> you can be doing your PVP and uh, dying in agony, maybe. Uh, no, don't do that either. <laughs> you can do the Mario parkour with somebody and you can be laughing at each other. Ha ha, I saw you fall in the lava. And <laughs> you can have all sorts of fun on the new Discord channel with Cubeville. Um, all the staff get to hang out there with all the citizens too. So you might catch us on there at different times. I hope to see you on there. And it was a ton of fun visiting Halloween Island. Um, I will miss it. I will miss it. But guess what comes after Halloween Island? The Winter Island! And it's super cool too. So don't worry. Don't, don't be sad that Halloween Island is going. I mean, you can be sad a little bit because there's so much cool stuff here. But don't be too sad for too long because Halloween Island or Holiday Island will be coming. Halloween? Holiday? Winter? Winter Island. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm not quite awake yet, I guess. I thought I was ready for this. Um, Winter Island will be coming soon, and we're going to have just as much fun over there. So I hope you all who celebrate Thanksgiving get to enjoy that. Have some time off of school. Get to come over here, finish your Halloween quests, get your cool stuff, and hang out with your friends, get some pictures. Meet us up on our new Discord channel for Cubeville. Not just my Discord channel for my YouTube channel, but the Discord channel for Cubeville. That's what I'm talking about on here. That's an awesome one. And um, I'll catch you all later sometime. Have a great day. See ya. Bye.